sounds pretty good, pretty good. But I'll tell you what, guys, these riders feed off crowd participation. So that means the louder you guys get, the more screams and applause, the higher they're going to go, the day more dangerous the tricks are going to become. Now, if you guys are really mellow and really quiet, they're going to do a great job, no doubt about it. But definitely keep the tricks inside their comfort zone. But if we get behind them with just a little bit of noise, I guarantee it they will take it to that next level. So what do you think? Do we have any loud people out here tonight? All right, that sounds awesome. Please stay behind the coned off area, especially on this grass side. Please stay behind those cones. And uh, on this front side, behind the cones as well, everyone. It's that way everyone stays nice and safe. So with that said, ladies and gentlemen, let's get these guys going with a little bit of noise as I introduce to you the 2013 BMX and Skateboard Pros. Throughout the course of the year, these riders do over 300 shows each and every year, nationwide. They're about almost 14 weeks into their summer tour, so this is actually their last stop of summer tour. One more time, this is your BMX and Skateboard Pros Trick Team. We're going to start off the show by introducing these riders one by one as well, right here on the flat ground. This is called Flatland Freestyle Riding. He has been doing it professionally for about 20 years now. He just got done with a 47 straight day run up in Seattle, Washington at a theme park. He's coming to you out of Los Angeles, California. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get loud for Mr. Gabe Weems. That's right, guys. Gabe Weed for the Flatland Freestyle. And up next, a rider up on top of the half pipe with the white full face helmet on. This guy does a little bit of everything out there. He's going to be riding the half pipe. He's going to be down here as well, riding these uh, obstacles down on this side. He's got X Games medals hanging on his wall back at home, all the way from Orlando, Florida. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Rob Nolly. I saw you jumping down there at the end. That's all right, he's got breaks. One more time. That's Rob Dolly. And our next rider on the skateboard, doing it up for Tony Hawk's company, Birdhouse Boards. This guy's been featured at the X Games, the Dew Tour. Traveled on the War Tour for many years as well, out at Daytona Beach, Florida. Ladies and gentlemen, Phil Pijal. All right, Bakersfield, that's what we like to hear. A nice, lively, active bunch out there. But we still have one more rider to introduce you to. Now we're gonna give him a second here to put his helmet on, and he's gonna come out here and show you guys what he does best. Now he's out of the San Diego area. He's been riding for over 15 years, doing tricks like the surfer right there. He currently rides for Miracle Bikes, as well as Troy Lee Designs. Doing his best Michael Jackson impersonation. This guy travels all around the country year-round doing shows, so he's used to big crowds and lots of noise. Let's put those hands together and welcome Dustin McCarty. All right, that sounds like a good start to a great show. Well, now that we've got those introductions out of the way, we're going to let these guys get warmed up. Dustin likes to get warmed up by doing lip tricks like this one right here. Looks like he might be coming in backwards. That's a 720 tail tap. First one of those we've seen out here at the Kern County Fair. A little bit of a 360 inside that quarter pipe down there. Now these are tricks done on the edge and lip of the ramp. Not quite taking it to the air just yet, but still pretty difficult and dangerous stuff. I think you guys are going to like this next one right here. How about Dustin McCarty and the tail lip fly out? One more time, guys. Let's give it up for Dustin. All right, whenever you're ready, we're going to drop in our pro skateboarder, Phil Hajal. And he's going to show you guys his version of lip tricks. Now these are done right there on the edge of that coping up there, that black piece of metal. He's going to be using that for all kinds of slides, grinds, stalls. Who knows, maybe even a hand plant like that one right there. Right into a foot plant. This guy's all over that vert ramp. Let's give it up, you guys. Phil Hajal. All right, now we're going to bring it back our Flatlander, Mr. Gabe Weed. And he's going to show you guys that you don't need a bunch of ramps or a skate park to do tricks on your bike. All you need is your bike, a flat ground, and some imagination. And for Gabe, it's been about 25 years of practice to be able to do tricks like that right there, the Mega Spin. He's out here on a daily basis doing these tricks. 
Now he rides about two to three hours a day, and that's the only way you're going to develop these kind of skills. How about this one? Front wheel only, forwards, backwards, forwards again. Now he's getting that back end around the other side. This guy's just combining trick after trick. It's a little quiet out there, Vegas. Be able to put those hands together. That's what we like to hear right there. A little bit of encouragement goes a long ways. And it looks like Gabe's not done. He's got one more mega spin for you guys. How about that? If that wasn't hard enough, throwing in a couple bar spins for good measure. That is Gabe Weed. All right, you guys. Who wants to see these guys take it to the air? Me too. All right, well, this is the guy we're going to have to convince right here. Justin McCarty. He specializes in doing big tricks on that quarter pipe and this box jump. How about that? A good 9, 10 feet on that quarter pipe. Right into a 360. That's just his first jump of the show. He's not done yet. How about this one? Cranking at that quarter pipe, floating backwards this time. We call that the alley oop. This time he's setting up for another jump. How about that? No hands, no feet. Superman style. Don't act like you're not impressed. All right, you guys, that's Justin McCarty. Drop it in our pro skateboarder, Phil Dijal. It's his turn to take it to the air. Now watch closely, look at this, already a good 6-7 feet above that 11 foot tall half pipe. That means he's about 18 feet in the air. Look at the back to back moves out of Phil, look at that sky on that side. How about that one, traveling sideways, coming in backwards, slapping that tail down. And finishing off with a hand pipe, there's a reason we call this guy Phil the Thrill. Alright, back to the flatland scene. It's time for Gabe Weed to bring the action. Check that out. As if the hang five wasn't hard enough, he's out there doing it no handed. Pretty tricky stuff. How about this one? No footed. Look at that. Balancing no feet. This guy's just combining trick after trick. And not only does Gabe ride bikes, he also sells bikes and bike parts too and cheap goods. BMX. So any of you kids out there need any bikes or parts? Come see Gabe after the show. He'll hook you up. So you know he knows what he's doing when he's out here doing tricks like this one. Watch this set up on that rear tire only. Watch this. One of my favorites right here. Switching those bars around. How about that? Bicycle behind him. No handed. In circles. Doesn't get much harder than that. And Gabe Weed out here making it look easy. Excellent work out of Mr. Weed. Whenever you're ready, Dustin McCarty, he's going to charge that quarter pipe down here. Now, he just ended with that no-handed Superman. Let's see what he's got in store for you now. Nice huge tail whip. Right into a tail whip on the box jump. Catching the pedals twice before he landed. <laughs> All right, but you know what, Bakersfield? I think he's got one more for you guys. Who wants to see one more out of Dustin McCarty? Better tighten up that chain, son. All right, here we go. Whenever you're ready, let's get behind him, Bakersfield. Let's make some noise. Let him know you guys want to see what he's got in store. Check that out. Two tricks in one. 360 tail whip out of Dustin McCarty. Now, for those of you who are paying attention, that means his bicycle went around two times, two revolutions, while his body did one. Pretty tricky stuff out of Dustin, and believe it or not, that's about the halfway point of our show. So that means he saved some of the biggest, hardest tricks for the second half of the show. So, we are going to change up the pace of the show here just a little bit. We're looking for a volunteer to come out here and give us a hand with this next part. One volunteer. Let's see here. I do. The taller the volunteer, the harder the trick becomes. You want to come on out here and give it a shot? All right, let's do it. This guy is uh, probably the tallest guy we've had in the last couple of days. What's your name? Arthur. All right, Arthur. Dustin's got some instructions for you. Thanks for coming out. All right, Arthur. What's up, man? Nice to meet you. You ever seen a bike show before? So you know why you volunteered? All right, perfect, man. You know why you volunteered? Well, we're going to need you to make your way right up on top of that ramp right there. All right, go for it. One, two, three. Here we go. On top of that ramp. Just like that, Arthur. Man, now that you're up there, Rob, are you, you sure you don't want to get someone else? He's a little tall. You feeling good? All right. What do you guys think? How many think this is a bad idea? So many people. Wow. How many don't care if it's a bad idea? Think Rob should jump up and over him anyway. <laughs> All right, here we go. Decisions in. All right, Arthur, do not move. Very important. You don't duck forward. You don't wave your hands. Now, you all right? 
Oh, you look a little nervous. You're good? Ah. Okay, just making sure. You know, he's a pro. He can do this almost every time. You have nothing to worry about. And, all right, well, I'll tell you what, even if something does happen, don't worry about a thing. He gets a flat tire, breaks his chain, accidentally knocks right into Arthur. Don't worry. Rob has his helmet on. He'll be fine. Don't worry about a thing. We're just kidding. I'll tell you what, Arthur, you stand there perfectly still. Don't move. We're going to give you this autograph card as well. All right, what do you guys think? Is the crowd ready? All right, here we go. One more thing, Arthur. Let's put those hands to the side. Yeah, it makes for a better picture that way. All right. Just like that. Look at that. Let's give it up to Arthur out here. Did not move a muscle. Didn't even blink. Let's give it up to Rob Nolly for making it as well. Hey, you just sit down, slide, or come on down, whatever, however you want to do it. Yeah, just like that. There's your autograph card. Thanks for being a good sport, man. Appreciate you coming out. All right on. Come after the show. Get that signed by the pros as well. Let's give it up one more time to Rob Nolly. Where'd he go? There he is. All right, guys, if anyone else is interested, autograph cards are just two bucks or free for the $10 hat or t-shirt. That brings us to the halfway point. We've got one more round for you. This is when all the hard tricks come out. So what do you guys think? Is the crowd ready for one more round? All right, here we go. We're going to bring Gabe Weed in one more time up on that back wheel. Spinning himself around. This guy's so consistent. I don't know how he does so many spins, doesn't get dizzy. He is just all over the place when it comes to riding that bike. Here we go, on the side that time, front wheel to back wheel combo. There's that bike rolling upside down. Check that out, right back, one hand, one foot. If he pulls that one, I know, yeah, look at that, pulling it right back to pedals. All right, here he comes. He's not done yet. He's got some more combinations for you. On his way in. Right there, front wheel, hang five. Right into those whips. Keeping it going. No hands at all. Only on the front wheel. So much balance, dedication. What do you guys think? One more time, guys. Game weed out here. All right, here we go. We're gonna go right back to the top of the half pipe. Here we go, Rob Nolly. Let's see what you got in store for us. Wait, what are you guys thinking? You gonna go for it? You got the timing down? What do you guys think? A doubles run? All right, here we go. Now this ramp is only 16 feet wide. They're gonna go two at a time on a little doubles run. Timing has to be perfect. So here we go, Kerr County. Let's get these guys good and fired up. One more time. Coming in hot. Here we go. Rob Nolly dropping on in. Check that out. Right up and over the top of Philly Zone. deck safely guys nicely done out there all right here we go we're gonna go right back to Gabe Weed coming back at you here we go Kerr County this is gonna be Gabe Weed's final run for our 630 show every show is a little different we've got one more at 830 coming in hot check that out up on that back wheel yeah there you go the more noise you give him, the better the tricks are going to be. All right, here we go. One of my favorites right here. Check this out. On the side of that front wheel. Bringing it in. Front wheel combo right to the back wheel. But watch this, guys. He has not done this one yet. Bike completely upside down. Seat inches from the ground. Bringing it in. One hand, one foot, and right back to the pedals. Right on game. All right, here we go. Check out this jump. Call this one the leap, the decade, right up and over the top. And pulling it off. All right, guys, one more combination. Now, this trick right here has literally, no joke, taken Gabe about 20 years to learn. He just got this one dialed in this year. All right, look at this one. Hooking the foot under the frame with no hands at all, guys. What do you guys think about Gabe Weed out there? Nice and done. All right, here we go. Rob Nolly, this is gonna be your final run on the half pipe, final run, guys. So if you guys wanna see about a 20-foot air off the ground, then you guys know what to do. Let's get him fired up one more time. This is gonna be his final run. 
Start things off with a big bar spin right there. Check this out. Just going huge. Huge tabletop. Exit it up. He is all over the place, right? Taking off his hands this time. On a fire. What do you guys think about Rob Nolly's tail whip? Coming in huge out there. Right into a 540. Ladies and gentlemen, Rob Nolly. All right. Here we go. Phil Hijal. This is going to be Phil's final run on the skateboard. Here we go. He wants to hear a little noise out there. Thank you, Phil. Phil Hijal's final run on the half pipe. Here we go. Airing it out sideways. Look at that. Just big backside. Huge judo air. Now with some combinations. Into a fakie. Oh, 360 burial. Come over here next to the table, next to the side of the ramp where Rob is. We will have t shirts and hats for sale, only $10. We also have autograph cards, only $2. Buy a $10 t shirt or $10 hat and get a free $2.